Hello guys, welcome to the channel. Hope you're all doing very well. And today, well this is my setup here. Um, this video is not about my setup. Um, I'll be doing a separate video on that. Um, I only play DCS with one monitor active. I have the other one for information and this is currently how I use it. And I have another two tablets that I have um, an app, third party or someone else's software and uh, I will go over that in another video like I said this video is not about that um, this video is about ergonomics and trying to make a DIY um, mount table mount for my HOTAS um, just got the rudder pedals but if we could do that maybe we could yeah I, I just think it'd be much better I know there's some benefits of having the joystick in the center it's realistic because that's how it is in May, well, a lot of aircraft and the F-18, which is why I fly a lot. So if you if you switch hands as well, you don't have to, you know, um, reach over a whole keyboard and everything. So it can be quite useful and it might be more comfortable. So that'd be awesome. Um, I was looking online at, you know, there's, there's some companies that do offer ones that are made with aluminium. They do look quite nice, but they're very expensive. They're very, very expensive, so I'm sure for the money, they're right, but I've, I'm sure we can come up with an alternative. So, uh, let's, let's see what we got, and let's start this project. Alright guys, so we popped in to our local home base, and got all this lot, including the saw, for 31 quid, so... So not bad, we've got two um, two bits of wood there, we're probably going to cut them in half. Got some brackets and, uh, and these things as well, so uh, let's try and make this into a HOTAS mount. Alright, it's all unwrapped. So I've never done anything like this before, so this is going to be a complete adventure. Um, guessing what we'll do first probably measure how far it needs to go down and maybe cut one of these like that um who knows let's we'll, we'll see how it goes well, i kind of lined it up now so let the soaring begin We got one. It's not too bad. We'll uh, make another now. Same size. Got to put a slight bit of uh, cardboard on there just to get it level. But it'll be it'll be level and fine. So just gonna put these on like so. Alright guys, finally uh, all, all set up here, so um, we'll jump into the Hornet and see how how she flies, so enjoy. Fitted uh, hot test mount, a uh, DIY hot test mount, just uh, cold start the Hornet, uh, just going to take off quickly, fly around and land and see how they feel, enjoy. Definitely feels much more accessible. Alright. Let's fuck roll.
guys, I'll, I'll put a thumbnail, um, a timestamp, as I always usually do in the video for the landing if you want to skip to that, but um, we've got got a fair amount of uh, fuel and this is pretty fun so we're just going to do some mountain surfing. So skip ahead if you want to skip ahead but we're just going to fly around. That feels much better. much better much more natural it really does make make a big difference actually landing fly over the lake here in a second Big improvement. It's definitely going to be one of those, one of those things. When you get used to it, it's like, how did I, how did I not fly with, uh, with the joystick in the center? It's in the, it's in the center in the, uh, in real life and in a DCS. So now it matches. And it does, it does feel awesome, I'm not going to lie, it, I'm not just saying that, it, it did, it does just feel more, it feels more accessible and comfy and it just feels really, really nice in general, so I would recommend, you know, if you can make it yourself for, for 30 quid or 31 quid, you know, I've still got some leftover wood and 
you know, this might not be the final, final um, version, but definitely worth doing it yourself. You know, doing it without paying loads of money, extortionate amounts of money, but well, not extortionate amounts of money. I mean, if you can afford it, the uh, the proper clamps, they're, they're always, you know, they're going to be much better. But if you can do it for, for cheaper, why not, you know? Um, and it, it, it feels amazing. So, yeah, definitely good, good solid review. And I would recommend, uh, good, rec yeah, solid recommend. So, try it, you know, if, if, you, if, it, if it messes up and you've got an old desk, it doesn't really matter. This desk, I, it's huge, it's massive. Um, and I got it for free on Gumtree. Uh, so, so that's awesome. Right. Oh, it feels miles better, guys. Now with the center. Uh, proper placement for the hotas and the rudder pedals. This feels awesome. Try and touch down earlier. A little bit early. need to learn to extend that air brake out as soon as I land. It's something I really need to learn to do. Taxi off the ramp here, off the runway. Rudder pedals are awesome. Getting used to them. A slightly fast taxi here. Seven. Hello to the uh, tanker, tankers, these are tankers, big uh, Boeings. Uh, it was a bit of a fast taxi.
show the shotgun. I, I, I didn't. I didn't film the start up, but. Shambles at the end then. But... Alright guys. Well comment, tell me what you think. Is it worth it getting a center center mount for your hotas? I would definitely say yes. But anyways, please take it easy. Um, it's been been fun doing this. Um, like I said, even if this this uh, kind of breaks or gets worn down, I, I you know I may I can make another one now. I'm pretty confident, but it's you know seems on there and it's seems all good. So. Um, at the moment this is great so um, thanks for watching guys take care bye bye